Welcome to Time Beat Breaking News Channel. Here are our breaking news today. 1. The Biden administration will not require COVID-19 vaccine passports, White House says. 2. Moderna COVID vaccine of the UK will be rolled out first today. The Biden administration will not require COVID-19 vaccine passports, White House says. The White House said that the Biden administration will not support a system requiring Americans to carry so-called COVID-19 vaccine passports, Press Secretary Jen Psaki said. The announcement comes amid privacy concerns, following some arguments that vaccine passport ownership is required to accelerate the reopening rate of international tourism and the domestic economy. President Biden's chief medical advisor, Dr. Anthony Fauci, said that the government will not be required to issue vaccinated passports to tourists or businesses until the pandemic ends. And I suspect that the federal government will be the main driver of the vaccine passport concept. They can be involved in making sure everything is done fairly and equally, he continued to the Politico Dispatch podcast. But I doubt whether the federal government is the most important factor that leads to that. In the U.S., the issue has become largely partisan. Republicans are largely against the concept. Two Ohio state legislators, for instance, recently told Fox News that they are planning to introduce a bill to preemptively forbid vaccine passports over concerns about privacy and government overreach. Meanwhile, New York deployed the Excelsior Pass and became the first state to deploy a digital vaccine passport recently. As more New Yorkers vaccinate and as key public health indicators continue to consistently hit month low rates. This is preparation for the muscle-based reopening process. Our scientific and attentive department, Gov. Andrew Cuomo said about vaccine passport deployment. Moderna COVID vaccine of the UK will be rolled out first today. According to Health Secretary Matt Hancock, doses of the jab will be rolled out in West Wales to provide a needed boost to the nation's rollout over the Easter weekend. The UK Administration of Medicines and Healthcare Products has confirmed that it will secure 17 million doses of the drug for the country and proceed with the dissemination of drug purchases domestically. This spring the emergence of a new US vaccine has always received anticipation, but yesterday, vaccine minister Nadim Zahawi turned down their impending arrival. He had said he expected doses to go into arms around the third week of April, with more volume expected by May. Ministers have warned that April will see a slowdown of the inoculation against the deadly virus, but the 500,000 batches of Moderna will keep these numbers steady until more AstraZeneca and Pfizer. Mr. Hancock said, I'm delighted we can start the UK rollout of the Moderna vaccine in West Wales today. The UK government has secured vaccines on behalf of the entire nation, and the vaccination program has shown our country working together at its best. Thank you for watching. We help you stay up to date all the news hourly. Please subscribe our channel to follow up the latest one.